<laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay guys, so we have an issue here. So Norden has bought three different kayaks and one of them is the better kayak. So we're gonna play what game? What's it called? Oya Peyasom. Okay, to see who gets the best kayak for the day, huh? So, so let's try. Odd ones out is the lucky one to get this. Right. Okay, okay, let's try, let's try. Oya Peyasom. Okay, okay, never mind. Okay, see you guys on the water. <laughs> oh, it's been a while since I've been on the kayak. Feels good. Oh yeah. Get the legs warmed up and let's head that way. All right, guys, what is up? Welcome back to IATV. So, it's been a while since I've posted a fishing video uh, in Singapore. So, yeah, today I'm actually out here with Fish on SG. So, that's Norden and that's Randy. And we're gonna be doing some kayak fishing for, uh, you know, the basic species, well, the common species, I, I should say, such as uh, snapper, sea bass, and uh, grouper. And maybe if we're lucky, we can hook onto some pelagics using a metal jig. Uh, but yeah, the setup I have today, custom gawas, it's rated up to PE1, and I'm pairing that with the uh, Shimano Stella 2.5K HG. And that's with uh, PE 0.8 line, to do like, you know, some light jigging and uh, running sinker use and uh, light tenya as well. For the heavier setup, which I want to do some uh, deep water tenyaing, or tenyaing, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, it's actually the Storm Belize, which is rated up to PE 1.5, and I actually put my uh, a power handle on my CQ 201 HG. So it's a little bit weird putting a power handle on that reel, but uh, I've done that because I don't really want to fully invest in an overhead setup. And you know, I can just try it out and see if this is a style of fishing that I'm gonna enjoy. And uh, yeah, let's see what we can catch. Uh, skies are pretty clear, and I think it's gonna be a really good day. So yeah, let's get to fishing. Woo. Ha <laughs> coral trout guys! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Let me just kayak a bit away. Look at that guys, it's a nice little foot sized coral trout. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Alright guys! first fish of the day it's a lovely coral trout and this one is definitely going inside the ice box so I caught this one on a running sinker with a prawn I was casting near the uh, breaker I uh, mean it's a lovely fish to catch uh, yeah man coral trout <laughs> Woo! Nice. he's like four meter five meter seven meter nine meter ah fuck yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Woo. MJ, bro. Woo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> MJ, MJ. Let's go. Is no structure. It's just like gradual drop-offs. Nice MJ, man, on the prawn again. <laughs> MJ man, MJ, Michael Jackson. <laughs> All right, there we go, guys. Mangrove Jack caught on the uh, running sinker with the prawn. That was nice. The fake was really aggressive. All right, let's go ahead and put the setup. Uh, thanks, thanks, thanks. <laughs> I came to take revenge, man. <laughs> All right, there we go, guys. Lovely little Mangrove Jack. Ouch. <laughs> caught on the old running sinker with a prawn. Ah oh man, that was really good. Okay, let's get the hook out and uh, put him on the stringer. 
The question is, where is the pliers? Okay, it's right here. All right, the hook I will put in the front. Woo! There's the MJ guys over here with fish on and uh, Norton and Randy. <laughs> Good stuff. All right, so we do have some rain uh, coming over to us in the distance. I can already feel that it's drizzling, uh, but that's absolutely fine. I'm still gonna fish around here. Uh, although I need to make sure that I don't crash into the breaker because the wind is gonna start picking up. Um, but yeah. Um, now, when you guys saw me fight the MJ, I think you guys noticed that I didn't uh, screw on my handle properly into the reel, which is why it went backwards before I went forwards again. And uh, my drag setting was a little bit too loose, uh, but that's fishing for you. Um, luckily the fish wasn't too big and I still managed to land it. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna tighten in the handle to my reel a little bit tighter now and uh, keep it at the drag setting that I'm at and uh, continue fishing. Uh, but yeah, good way to start the trip. Woo! Very windy, huh? Let's go, let's go! Finally, we're over here, we are a little bit protected from the wind, uh, that was pretty tiring to actually pedal from the uh, breaker that we're playing all the way here. Right now the water is about 10 meters, uh, let's get a bit nearer to the breaker and then uh, cast my running sinker again. Whew, a nice little protected area um, and uh, yeah. Alright, so the wind is coming from my right so I think I'll uh, fish on this side and just slowly position the kayak to actually drift down that way and uh, see if we can pick up another mangrove jack or a finger mark snapper or a sea bass or a species of grouper so yeah let's get uh, right into it after i take a little water break seven six okay four 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 meters here huh okay what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna cast uh to the shallow part and then slowly bounce it back i think my prawn has gone anyway so yeah let's go and do that hello prawn hello hello sir hello okay i want you thank you all right it's nice and calm here and the wind has died down which is very nice it's died down and we're in like a little protected uh area so let's position the kayak so i can make a cast and uh, slowly bounce my running sinker back Twenty. Ah, okay. <laughs> try again, try again. <laughs> Say, please come out, fish, please come out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, got one, got one, got one. Grouper, grouper, should be grouper. Kim. <laughs> Kim. Hey, <laughs> come, come, hey, hey. <laughs> okay, okay. I got it, I got it. Hello, Kim! Randy says take a picture, I say you go in the ice box. <laughs> yes, bro! Kim! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Oh, I'm hitting all the species today, huh? <laughs> I want to take revenge, man. <laughs> oh, not a bad size scheme also. Look at that, guys. Nice. <laughs> it's a pretty good start to the trip so far, huh, guys? I have three out of five species that I don't mind catching today. I think I'm left with a finger mark snapper and a grouper. And uh, yeah, I have the sea bass, mangrove drag, and coral trout. 
All right, so it's been a great session so far uh, using bait. So I think what we're gonna do to end the session off is we're gonna use some artificial jigs uh, in the deeper parts of the water, probably about 15 to about 20 meters, and uh, see if we can pick up one or two, two more fish to uh, uh, end the day on a high note. And uh, yeah, it's a pretty hot day. I didn't bring my long pants, so I'm kind of regretting that right now. As you guys can see, uh, my legs, they're getting burnt to a crisp. Uh, but it's my own mistake, that's fine. Uh, yeah, anyway, let's get to the spot. Let's do some jigging with a 30 gram and a 60 gram jig. I might use bait, see how we get along. And uh, yeah, update you guys once we're over there. Woo! guys so I caught myself uh, a little leather jacket on the dual uh, hey, the dual drag drag metal cast or drag cast metal first time using the jig first catch on the jig <laughs> it's pretty cool let's go ahead and uh, release this guy right, well, that's a quick little uh, bonus catch uh, at the last part of the day which is always good um, unlocked a new species for today's trip Alright guys, so that brings us to the end of the episode. Now, if you did enjoy it, do be sure to give it a thumbs up. And uh, if you guys are interested in booking a session with Norden from Fish on SG, I'm going to leave his contact details as well as his carousel page in the description box down below. So do be sure to go ahead and check that out. Now, uh, overall, it was a pretty good session. Uh, I used bait during the first half. I cleared three different species. And I used the artificial jig towards the end and I managed to catch the leather jacket. So that's four species in total for today. And that was pretty awesome. Um, so I can't wait to go back out there and do some more kayak fishing. So stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next episode, which should be... Uh, I don't know. I have yet to decide what type of fishing I want to do in the next couple of weeks. Uh, but yeah, <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one.